Oh my god. Superstar couple Taylor Swift and Travis Kelsey are making the most of their free time with a new romantic reunion. Tavies 87 exclusively reports. The pair have moved to Rhode Island. The power couple have reunited for another late summer getaway, this time spotted on the balcony of the singer's epic Rhode Island mansion today. The $17 million vacation home has become a popular spot after being the site of Taylor's legendary Independence Day parties. However, the pop superstar was forced to miss this year's festivities due to her 51-date European tour, which ended on Tuesday. But Taylor returned to her iconic vacation home for the first time this summer, now with her boyfriend in tow. And it looks like their friends and family, including Chiefs quarterback Patrick Mahomes, joined them. Locals and fans were quick to notice the pop sensation was back after dozens of armed guards were spotted along the perimeter of the property. Taylor's security team chased away fans desperate to catch a glimpse of the era's tour star, but not before snapping a selfie in her driveway. One group even approached the guards and offered to pay $50 for a glimpse of the star and her beau. Taylor and Travis were joined by Patrick Mahomes and his wife Brittany as they soaked up the preseason sunshine, with the quarterback and linebacker enduring a tough preseason that included three straight losses. Kylie and Jason joined the Chiefs star studded squad with their children as the son continues to enjoy his first post-retirement season and ahead of his new TV role with Amazon Prime, which starts next month. Taylor appeared to be letting loose after missing her annual 4th of July party because she was on tour, with sold-out shows across Europe. The Lovebirds, who started dating around a year ago, have spent much of their time flying to see each other in between their busy schedules since the start of their romance. They have previously shared various apartments across the country but it is believed this is the first time Travis has been to his girlfriend's Watch Hill home. They spent a week together during the pop icon's most recent break from touring, which coincided with the NFL's March break, DailyMail.com reported at the time. The pair have been enjoying some quality time together at her Beverly Hills base after a busy few months of international travel and engagements as a long-distance couple. Swift reportedly purchased the colonial-style mansion, also known as High Watch in cash in 2013. Situated on five acres with 11,000 square feet, eight bedrooms, ten bathrooms and a private beach, the sprawling estate is the most expensive home in the state. With a spacious backyard and a large pool overlooking the ocean, the estate is the perfect summer home. And Kelsey won't be the first boyfriend to visit the iconic estate. And now the couple can look forward to spending the last few weeks of summer together at the estate before the NFL linebacker returns to Kansas City to start the season next month. Sources told DailyMail.com that Swift landed back in the United States on Wednesday, while Kelsey, who played in preseason games, arrived in Rhode Island on Friday. Kelsey was seen being the supportive boyfriend of his girlfriend during her European tour earlier this summer making appearances in Dublin, Paris, London and Amsterdam. He attended her final concert in Gelsenkirchen, Germany, where he was seen hugging the pop star at the end of her performance in July, before heading to Chiefs training camp in Kansas City. He then kicked off the NFL preseason on August 8, with the team taking on the Chicago Bears on Thursday. He'll be back on the field on September 5 for the first official game of the NFL season. Meanwhile, Taylor will enjoy a nice two-month break before starting the final leg of her era's tour in Miami in mid-October. And it's likely she'll return the favor by supporting her man at his games while she's on hiatus. While he may be busy training for another exciting leg on the pitch, he still has time for romantic gestures. Earlier this week, the soccer star reportedly spent more than $30,000 on flowers for Taylor to celebrate the European leg of the era's tour. According to The Sun, Kelsey ordered 51 giant boxes of red roses to greet his girlfriend when she returned to the United States this week. The singer returned to London's Wembley Stadium for five performances of her smash hit tour following the cancellation of shows in Vienna, when a planned terrorist attack was foiled by authorities. Swift now has no shows on her schedule until the era's tour, which has surpassed $1 billion in revenue, returns to the United States in October and ends in Canada in December. A report emerged last week that said Kelsey and Swift have found ways to prioritize each other despite their hectic schedules and being in different countries for a lot of their relationship. Taylor and Travis always prioritize each other even when they are physically apart. 
they are still in constant communication texting and FaceTiming each other, per ET. Swift and Kelsey are very affectionate with each other even when they're apart, added ET, with the chief showing his affection for the anti-hero singer through lavish gifts.